Good day ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another top 5 plays from Triptych. Let's dive straight into the VS Gaming League action with number 5 featuring Jean de Paul on an unkillable Back Alistair. Oh. Uh, damage oh. is going to come oh. through onto the Alistair, yes, Ach, onto the Leona. And uh, it does look like they're going to keep chasing this. Alistair is sticking around. WQ does go and she doesn't have vision of him. He does. At number 4 we have a wear sun bear with an epic snipe coming out of his ergot. Yeah, she's gonna have to go back. She has to go back. Oh, they are taking Drake, and they do get it before they even. Oh, Maokai twisted advance once again. Great Urgot OT onto the Diana. Great fear coming out. The Jinx does get excited, and the Vayne just walks a little too close. Echo doing damage on the backside. Urgot just wrecking the team once again. He is go yeah over the wall. Great to work. Fun or read from the Urgot, and I'm not too sure that my person will get away. Yeah, it was no, obvious, but no, no, there he goes. Not he's gonna get the stun, then he's gonna get the hook if he needs it. Ergot. Oh. Our number three play has Scout from OG Vindicators demonstrating how to use Oriana's orb for the turnaround. Did you see the echo going on to the Oriana? Does use the OT to draw him back. Does get the dash and Oh she does get away with the shield and destroys the echo actually with that burst damage coming out. Number two has Hard Rock from a League of Legends team securing the win for his team with a simple hook. The, the Not picking this fight with a 10 and 3 set, and I fully understand that. Clayton uh, doing damage to the top tower, but now, oh, he gave onto the Clayton, does get the land, the land in the way. Now, Thresh is going to be locked down, and that's going to be a living Thresh. They are pushing to the mid lane, back up the Clayton to secure this inhibitor, and next to Tyrant, will they be able to finish it off? They are going for it, and they do get the GG! It's a great game coming out here for a League of Legends team, kind of using their Kenshin as base to push in the mid lane um, with that inhibitor down and taking the final uh, Nexus. For, for our number one play, we have a clutch pentakill coming out of RSA Snoopy's Diana. Oh, the Caitlyn is gonna die. Dead. But, oh, great ulti from the Valkos coming in. But not enough yeah, damage. Not enough. does come through. There is the Valkos, the Jarvan, no. and the Diana onto the, the Valkos. But the Trundle does go. The shutdown coming down on the, the Valkos. Trundle does get the kill, I think it is, on Poppy the Jarvan. Poppy is tanky as well. Poppy is gonna get the kill onto the oh, Diana. No. And now she, she gets it back on the quadruple kill. Can she get the Penta? She's attacking this Trundle. The Trundle trying so hard. Oh. And then, ah, oh, going to get the Penta kill. Oh. And for oh, our bonus trade, clip, think, we do have tank wars result resulting in an so, equal so, ending. So one for ones are not often worth. We uh, do see a trade the in the top side just quickly. Uh, Malka is going onto this Urgot. Uh, does flash for the damage, does hit Why? him, but the smash doesn't work. Now the Urgot can possibly turn around, does get the flash, root does oh, come out. Oh. Thank you so much for watching and we hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to hit that subscribe button for any future videos being released and remember, that you can catch the live action on my Twitch channel in the link below.